Hey there, geeks. Tim with MajorGeeks.com. Today we're going to show you how to create a shortcut so that you can run Google Chrome without extensions. It's a pretty neat way to run your browser if you're having problems on a certain website with one of your extensions. You don't know which one's quick and easy. Now, another thing before we start, just as an option, if you don't run into this problem a lot, just click these three dots right here and try the new incognito window. That might help you. So as you can see, it doesn't save your browsing history cookies. So that can actually be a problem depending on what you're doing. So it doesn't always work. So if you can use incognito, that's one way around it. Otherwise, let's create a shortcut. Super easy to do. All you need to know is where to find your Google Chrome.exe so we can copy the path. Now it's going to be in, open your file explorer, program files or program files x86. I do believe it's mo most likely to show up in program files. So you're looking for Google Chrome. So if I check program files, there's Chrome. If I check x86, there's Google, but no Chrome. So now I know there's my executable right here. Google, Chrome, application. There it is right there. So we're going to right click on Chrome EXE and make sure we click on, oops, I don't think I did it. Copy as path or control shift C. Not copy, copy as path. Now we can minimize everything. We're going to head to the desktop and we're going to add dash dash disable dash extensions. Let me show you. Really easy to do. Right click on your desktop. New shortcut. Control V hit the space dash dash disable dash extensions and if you're not comfortable doing it here are both of the exact paths here depending on where your Chrome is you can actually copy and paste this by getting a link to this tutorial in the video description pretty easy right once you've got that in there just like that again just make sure there's a space right here after the quote click next name it I would name it something like Chrome no extensions then you know what it is because it's gonna look just like this finish and there you have it let's give it a whirl there you go so there it would be with no extensions now if you change your mind later you don't need it anymore or you're cleaning up your desktop just delete it. It's just a shortcut. Right click, delete, or click on it and press the delete key. Just like that, it's gone. So there you have it. Once again, if you have any problems, just check the tutorial because you can always copy and paste this. Sometimes you forget. You got to make sure you get that extra dash in there. You got to make sure you get that space after the quote. But if you're having trouble, come to the page and copy and paste our code, and that should get the job done for you. And there you have it. Pretty neat way to run Google Chrome without extensions. You know the drill. Click like if we helped you out. You could always use another subscriber or two. Thanks for watching. As always, see ya.